crisis of refugees and asylum seekers has rocked the world, with headlines generated across the world as a result. According to the UN Department of Economic and Social Affairs, refugees and asylum seekers are described as a global phenomenon that is growing in scope, complexity and impact. But what are refugees and asylum seekers? According to the Geneva Convention, a refugee is a person owing to well-funded fear of being persecuted for reasons of race, religion, nationality, membership of a particular social group or political opinion, is outside the country of his nationality and is unable or weak to such fear, is unwilling to avail himself of the protection of that country. An asylum seeker is a person who has left their home country as a refugee and is seeking asylum in another. Their claim for refugee status has not yet been improved. Therefore, all refugees are, are asylum seekers, but not all asylum seekers are refugees. The right to seek asylum has been in place since the 600 CE. If you went to a church or another holy place, you could claim asylum. However, it was not until 1951 when refugees were defined. The 1951 Refugee Convention is the legal document that is ratified by 145 state parties, defines the term refugee and outlines the rights of the displaced, as well as the legal obligations of states to protect them. The convention was signed after 40 million refugees settled in Europe alone, as a result of the Second World War. Nearly thousands of refugees have sought asylum in Australia over the past decade, and currently there are 1.3 refugees for every 1,000 people in Australia. The annual refugee quota is currently 20,000 people. From 1945 to the early 1990s, more than half a million refugees and other displaced people were accepted into Australia. Many countries have well-equipped refugee camps and provide all basic rights, including education. While many refugees camps are no longer unorganised and filthy tents set for people seeking peace, some important ones still are, like Manus Island, Nauru and Christmas Island. Some ideas that could assist in resolving the problem of refugees and asylum seekers include allowing a higher percentage of asylum seekers to legally seek refuge in Australia. Also, more areas such as woods and unused forests should be transformed into areas for refugees to live in. Another good way to assist refugees is to host them in your house for a period.